Hey everyone, I just wanted to do a quick video for you today. Um, our studio is in major makeover um, mode. <laughs> we are painting walls and moving things around and Ellen is moving all of the garage things out and moving them to his shed. So we are going to take over the whole garage as our studio. Um, we'll have a video coming up on that maybe next week or so when we get everything in place But I want to do a quick dirty pour for you today um, Yesterday I did a pour over so today. I just thought I would do a quick dirty pour so I'm going to use um, three cups And I'm going to spray them with the WD-40 silicone spray and that's just to release the paint from the cup. Um, I don't use it to create cells. I have paintings everywhere. We emptied the bun rack this morning and I've got resin work everywhere. I gotta be careful I don't drip on anything. So, I wanted to do some turquoises and some aquas. Um, getting some of these paints that uh, have still have the nails in them we're transferring them out with um, erasers so oh, I haven't let it lost for words today got too many things on my mind okay and I want some Seamus Pearl so this is Craft Smart Native Turquoise Metallic and this is Seamus Pearl um, I think they changed the name now to Pearl Seamist so if you go to Michael's and you want to get it, um, it's Pearl Sea Mist. And I'm also going to use some Artist Loft Aqua. And some Lucas Arctic. So I'm going to get some light aqua colors here. And then I want to darken some of it up. So I'm going to go ahead with the Grumbacher Thalo Green. And the Soho Phalo Green Blue. It's a little more um, green in there. I do need one uh, turquoise color, and I think I'll use the Lucas Turquoise. And I'm going to be layering this with black and white. Um, I do need one contrasting metallic, and I think I'll use the gold. Okay, so I'm going to start with some white. Grab my black one here. So I usually put about a tablespoon of each color in when I'm layering. Uh, let's start with the aqua. And then I'll go with the phthalo green blue. And the sea mist pearl. Some turquoise. Here's where I'll add some black. And some gold. I always like the gold next to the black. Uh, let's see. Grumbucker Thalo Green. Lucas Arctic. And the Craft Smart Native Turquoise. This is metallic. A little bit more black. And a little bit more gold. I'm just shooting out two strands there. It's funny. Must be the way I cut the tip of the bottle. <laughs> and phthalo green blue. And some more of the sea mist. That should be plenty. All right. 
am going to give them a little swirl, though. Some cute cells coming up to the top. Put that right on the corner of my canvas. And I'm just going to pour. Where'd the black go? <laughs> I always have to think, where do I want that cup to go? <laughs> All right, let me give it a little torch. I'm just popping some air bubbles on the first pass. After we tilt, we'll go in and see if we can find some more cells. All my paint is in the middle. So I'm going to head down to this corner here. We were up till midnight painting one wall to get it done so that we can shift some things around and start in another area. It's going to be nice having um, some flowing juju in here because right now it's so chaotic. I mean, I'm stepping over things to get to places in the studio. It's not, it's dangerous, you know. <laughs> And with my knee being um, injured, I'm trying to be so careful, and I can't, I can't um, squat or anything because the pain is still there. Okay, so that's looking pretty cool. But I did manage to take ten of my babies out of the bun rack that we were resin and I only have one that needs another coat so that was good so I have a bunch that need to be wired and now that I've got my wall painted I'll be able to take some pictures and get those up on Etsy hopefully by the by Monday so I'm kind of liking those big cells there it's kind of um they look rocky. The gold makes it look more like a cream, but when that dries, of course, it'll be metallic. But I think that's it for this one. I think I'm not gonna um, manipulate it at all. So, oops, I do see a clump though. But if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and click below and click on that notification bell. You'll get notified when I upload my next video. Click like and share and leave a comment. Join us on Facebook. Um, we do post quite regularly on there. But that's where I do all my question answering. Um, if you're looking for supplies, shop with us with our Amazon shop. That link is below. For um, Stone Coat Art Coat Resin, the code is still available. It's CWA, all in caps at checkout. You'll save $30 off an $80 order. Um, check out our Etsy shop and our Redbubble. We have fan mail now, um, post office box 863 in Youngsville, North Carolina, 27596. Um, we're also still doing the GoFundMe with Nate Cerami um, to get him here to do a three-day collab in November. So check that out too. Um, all the links will be below. You won't have to rewind to write anything down, but you'll be able to see all the links below. So thank you so much for watching, guys, and I will see you all on the next one. Bye now.